Hey what's up everyone this is Nash and in this video I'm going to review Android custom room called AOSIP for my OnePlus One. This room is based on Android 7.1.1 and is CF based AOSP room. AOSIP stands for Android Open Source Illusion Project. So let's clear that illusion. Unfortunately this room is not rooted and you will have to flash super su file. Now let's talk about features and customization. When it comes to features, this room is beast. Features like status bar, quick setting, custom notification header, amazing pulse mode, Lock screen customization, Omni recent panel, and other hundreds of features can be found in Owl's Nest. Yes, that's the tab's name, Owl's Nest. Definitely goes with the theme, and all the features are properly organized, so it's easier for you to find it later on. For customization, this room is not only dependent on features, it has full OMS Substratum theme engine support. You can make your phone look stunning with beautiful Substratum themes on Play Store. And in case you want to check out my favorite themes, just click the i button. I have tested probably 100 rooms in my life and from my experience I can say that this room is made with so much conviction and passion because it has amazing boot animation, custom wallpaper and as mentioned above custom header image, beautiful animation and unique and custom theme. And that's very important if you are making a new custom room. Moving on let's talk about camera. This room has Google camera which is not available on Play Store anymore because Google doesn't like it. I personally like Google camera over Snapdragon camera because the UI is so simple and it's super snappy, super fast, quick to autofocus and it can shoot in 4K UHD and of course with manual exposure option. Have a look at some photos and 4K video sample I took with this camera. So we talked about features, customization and camera, now let's talk about performance and stability. This room is fantastic despite of so many features, no lags, no reboot and no F4 close. RAM management is excellent. No physical graphical glitches, Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, double tap to wake, everything is working perfectly. And also not to forget Google Assistant is working from first boot. Moving on let's talk about battery life. I got around 5 hours of screen on time with my normal usage that include Google+, WhatsApp, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, sometimes YouTube videos and brightness at 50% all the time. Even the standby time is amazing. I left my phone at 100% without charger in the night and in the morning it was 99%, only 1% drop overnight. So awesome features, nice boot animation, substratum support, nice battery life and AOSP CAF based room. I'm going to give this room 4.6 out of 5. It's definitely worth trying and it can be your next daily driver. I will give the link below for OnePlus One, OnePlus 3 and OnePlus 3T. Like this video if you appreciate my efforts. 
and check out other hundreds of room reviews on the channel. Who knows you might like one of them. I will provide playlist for all the rooms in the description box below. And subscribe if you love your smartphone. This is Nash and I will see you tomorrow.